Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So yesterday we had a look at the desktop browser market share um, for the stat counter survey results for January 2023. And if interested, just to have a quick look at the desktop Windows version market share worldwide, as stat counter have also posted those recently for January 2023. Now, um, starting from the back and then moving to the front um windows xp is still holding on it doesn't surprise me um windows xp is still very popular in some regions of the world believe it or not and uh, for december was 0.48 percent slightly down at 0.45 percent for january windows 8 8.1 and windows 7 have all fallen in their market share as all three uh, operating systems now are unsupported officially and uh, um for Windows 8, that was 0.67% for December, 0.62% for January. 8.1, 2.59, down to 2.31%, and quite a, a quite a, a drastic uh, decline for Windows 7, 11.18% to 9.62%. And um, obviously, the operating system now, um, a lot of the users using Windows 7 were in business environments with the ESU version so that would be your extended security updates and uh, um, that now has ended support so a lot of those users are moving on now to other versions of the operating system and uh, yeah we can see windows 11 is slowly increasing in its market share 16.93 percent to 18.13 percent so it has cross crossed uh, the 18 percent threshold and is ever so slightly um, increasing in its market share um, every month I do post these stat counter survey results. And then Windows 10 still dominant and has actually increased as well from 68.01% to 68.75%. And I think the reason for that is because of this. These three versions of Windows are now unsupported. So a lot of users moving on to Windows 10 and also to some extent uh, Windows 11. But nonetheless, just a quick video to go through those. Uh, percentages for the desktop Windows market share worldwide for January, according to the Stat Counter Global Stats. And we, as I always say, um, although not 100% accurate, uh, these surveys will just give us a good indication. But we always take them with a pinch of salt. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.